Um, you know, look at social media. You know, look at what it's, you know, doing to people, right? Uh, a lot of girls think that if they can, you know, achieve a shortcut by going on social media and shake a little bit and get a million views. And a lot of guys direct messaging them, you know, compliments. And um, we can only guess what's in somebody's head. We never know for sure. But it appears as though... Uh, a lot of them believe that that millionaire or billionaire will say, hey, you look nice. You know, will you come? Can I marry you? Can we, you know, get married? Um, in some cases, those women are do attract men who are wealthy um, and they fly them out. But it's usually just to have some fun and they send them back and then they'll get somebody else next time. Right. And then guys who do stuff like that or girls are a certain type of of person that like is that really what you were looking for you know but then you try to manipulate them but they wind up manipulating you because they have the power of manipulation that brought you there in the first place so you're going to them and in the art of war it says um when you attack emptiness and fullness it's like stones thrown on eggs the eggs are sure to break right um and that's what that is you know and so the girl who's, who's doing that and trying to land this guy, she's fighting uphill, you know. In the Art of War, Chapter 7, Arm Struggle, it says, Never face a high hill and never oppose someone with their backs to a hill. Now, you're probably thinking, what do you mean, man? You, you're talking about, like, a relationships and you're trying to date people and, and relationships and all that is like a war? Yes. Yes. It's exactly that. It's just on a very small scale, right? Uh, or it's, it's subtle or it's subliminal. And this is like an undercurrent. And you might not see it. They see it. And whenever you don't know someone's... Um, motive they win right so you have to understand people from a primal a primordial level right what are their primal desires you know um, because people by nature are selfish even two people in a relationship are selfish but they're getting what they want so it's like a good fit you know and and so it works but they're using each other but there's a lot of utility because they're using each other in a complimentary way like two businesses that that work together I mean technically they're using each other right um, but if it's a good fit and one benefits by giving to the other and in one way and the other uh, company benefits by giving to them in another way and they're receiving and they're both giving and so um, it's it's a fit you know even in friendships in family in relationships in any type of interaction between human beings.